absolute scale refers to the real world size of an object. In the case of this diagram, or our example project, this means the virtual car will look and fit in the world as an actual physical car would. Meaning these dimensions will line up with the actual physical car model. Some great scenarios for this type of experience would be for users when viewing or sizing furniture in their house, taking a look at a car in their driveway, or seeing how a new coffee machine looks in their kitchen. Responsive scale refers to the fact that your experience will always open in relative size. Furthermore, the scale of the scene is determined by the initial height or Y value of the camera in the scene. Lower camera heights result in larger content. Higher camera heights scale the content smaller. The initial height of the camera translates to the distance to the surface. Taking a look at our diagram here, let's say you open up the experience with an initial camera distance from the desk. That may be quite small. The virtual car will open up with the same screen real estate as if you opened it up via the ground. However, since your initial height from the detected surface is smaller, it will appear smaller, and so forth with the car on the ground or other surfaces. So it's relative. This can be opened on a desk, it can be opened on the top of a building, it can be opened on a train, so that experience can be viewed in many different environments.